We have a vision to stop hunger and malnutrition. And uh, our goal presently as Pan-African parliamentarians has been to come up with a global a law, a law that will be able to handle a relative law, an instrument that will be able to determine how farming is done, how food is preserved, how people are able to gain and acquire the cultural means which is there for them to be able to produce and store food and for the, the continent to be able to provide food even worldwide. In Cameroon, the Minister of Agriculture and other ministries have engaged fully. They are able to subsidize farmers. They are able to give tools. They are able to be to able to give fertilizers. They are able to create compost, manure system. They are able to create even uh, corporations where rice is produced, where irrigation is undertaken. And uh, presently, because of uh, insecurity, in some areas, the government gives direct support. The, the fishery program in Cameroon, there is uh, the Green Sahel program in the north. There is, because we have a desert, and then we are talking about conservation, because uh, the climate issues have been able to affect some of the parts of, this, of our country. And so, so much has been done. And uh, in terms of fertilizers, in terms of green uh, energy, and uh, we believe that uh, within a very short period, the element of hunger will be history in Cameroon. So I think uh, this conference is so important. The FAO system is functional in Cameroon. They're doing a lot. The current uh, conferences are ongoing, co-sponsored by FAO on the activities that have to do with food and nutrition. Uh, we know Cameroon is a home. We are hosting a lot of refugees from other countries. And we are trying as much as possible through international organizations like the FAO and others to be able to produce food and feed those refugees. We are actually coming from the Chopka area uh, where we have uh, the forests. We equally have uh, the water resources. We equally have the mineral resources and want to now transform these resources so that these resources now can be able to uh, fetch uh, food. Because the plantations that we have for bananas, we have uh, rubber, we have, uh, we have pineapple production. We have a lot of green uh, foods that we produce, pineapples, uh, oranges, uh, tomatoes and uh, what we need now to do is just to get the transformation of these products and then we give them some value. That is the, the best thing that we are trying to do in Cameroon.